Hi everyone, welcome back to the Crypto Carlos Fandango channel. Um, I thought I'd uh, do today's video on the um, Cheer Roadmap. Um, I had a look at this earlier on today and uh, saw a couple of things that I thought might be of interest. Um, especially you probably saw in the community channel, I put a note about the plot filter and that um, it seemed to be earmarked for the second half of this year or considered to be earmarked for that time. Um, so I thought we'd have a look at the roadmap um, and I'm a bit... I'm a bit disappointed because as soon as I decided to do it and I had a look at it, lo and behold, what comes up on my YouTube feed, but the poor investor doing a um, a little dive into the roadmap also after seeing the Chia YouTube uh, um, uh, video sent out a couple of weeks ago. So um, I'm probably going to be going over some of the stuff that he's done, but um, I assure you I didn't see that video before I decided to do this. Um, but the roadmap at Cheer is worth going and having a look at because apart from being able to see what they've already shipped, you see there's a tile here for every sort of initiative that they've um, put out. You know, um, this one will probably be more familiar to you about the improvements to the Blade Bit 2 for um, plotting on disk. Um, but th it's these areas that are quite interesting. So quarter one, which is pretty much till the end of this month. Um, you can see everything on on there that they're planning to do, um, including this ASIC Time Lord, which I do not understand at all, so I'm not going to go into that. Um, quarter 2 has got some interesting things in it. Um, support for GPU plotting, one of them. And, and this one, which I like the sound of, plot compression support. So they're, they're thinking of um, releasing an in an updated plot format that adds support for the creation of both compressed and uncompressed plots. So uh, farmer and har harvesters will be able to um, harvest compressed plots, even with a CPU. Um, so that that's only quite interesting. Um, but um, apart from that, it's the under consideration ones here in the second half of this year. And the ones that caught my eye... Well, the one we've already spoken about on my channel, which was the lowering of the plot filter over time. So, um, that, yeah, there's all the details of it there, and they are considering it for the uh, the second half of this year. So um, I suppose that depends on what the interest level is on it, and I'll show you that in the morning, In sorry, in a minute, because um, this one is what I was looking at. This one stood out to me. Support for GPU harvesting. So um, this is all about using GPUs to uh, harvest uncompressed or compressed plots. K32, K33 and K34. Um, so this would allow farmers to use their existing GPUs to harvest plots. Um, offloading the CPU. So that sounds amazing because, you know, there's quite a lot of us that have got a lot of um, NVIDIA GPUs hanging around, not doing a lot at the moment. Um, we're sure we could spare, you know, one or two or whatever to help with them um, with harvesting, take the load off of uh, the CPU. Um, so it'd be interesting to see if this goes past consideration and moves into like the latter end of the year for delivery or whatever. And it'd be interesting to see what what type of um, GPUs would be able to use for it. Um, you know, hopefully something, you know, quite, quite low end, I would have thought. Um, 3060 or something like that, 3060 Ti. Um, I wouldn't think you'd need anything more than that, but it'd be interesting to see. No mention of AMD, um, which is pretty much across the board. If you look at a lot of the initiatives on the board, they are all mentioning in NVIDIA, um, which is a bit disappointing because, um, you know, AMD cards are good as well, um, like for like, I think. But um, the main thing is, you know, if you're, a, if you're a cheer farmer, no matter how small a farmer you are, if you want your voice to be heard, you should go to this roadmap. 
because it does give you the facility on every one of these initiatives to have your say. So you can say, oh, yeah, I think this is a nice to have or I think it's very important and it would solve a major need or it's critical. You know, it, without it, I might consider, you know, discontinuing GM farming completely. So um, you can select whichever one of these you think is relevant to you. You can even add some more detail in. Um, unfortunately, you have to put an email address in before you can submit it. So there are um, privacy policy considerations to take in. Um, but, um, you know, if you if you want your voice to be heard, this is the, the place to do it, I think. Um, if there's something that stands out to you and you think, yeah, we need this, um, go, go on and, you know, um, leave, leave your... Leave your uh, two penneth on there, and we'll we'll see this uh, this number rise up here, and obviously it'll be flagged to them, and they'll take it uh, more seriously. So um, I'll definitely be doing that for this one because GPU GPU harvesting sounds good to me. Um, as I say, the, a lot of us have the hardware hanging around. Um, this one. Oh, it'd be good if they could delay this. Um, it still worries me, even though I had a good read of the documentation behind it, uh, the CHIP12 documentation, but uh, it's still a little bit vague as to, you know, whether it's uh, going to cause us issues or not. Um, but, uh, yeah, there's quite a, quite a few things on there about wallets, um, developer tools for wallets coming, um, uh, a cold wallet mode. This was another good one, actually. You know, a mode where you won't have to set up a separate cold wallet you can generate the keys within the main wallet um and it won't you won't even have to connect to a network um those keys will be generated sort of offline so that's quite good as well and that might be worth putting a putting your name to um but don't let me uh influence you in any way um if you feel, um, have a look around and see what you think of what's coming up and what they're proposing and uh, put your mark on it if you want Anyway, I hope that's been useful. Um, uh, you know, please give it a thumbs up if you can. Um, and, it, you know, it, it would help greatly uh, the channel if you subscribed and hit the bell notification. Um, and, and let me know what in the, uh, in the comments what you think of this. You know, what sort of things on here interest you? What would you like to see? You know, the more we talk about it, the more they'll listen. Okay, so that's all for now, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>